So we're in the middle of historic Birmingham this morning in lovely Edge Baston to see Sally Manor. Yeah. Should we go Charlotte? Yeah. Let's do it. Here we go. Dating back to medieval times, the timber frame Sally Manor is made up of two distinct and incredible buildings. Now this is a really historic place right near Cadbury World in the middle of Bourneville area. So lots of history to find out about today. And this is a museum that always has lots on. And on our visit, Harry Potter fun. We're going to make a wand, aren't we? Do some drawing, Charlotte. Then magic pen, Charlotte. So it's like Harry Potter magic. Wow, look. Look at that. Magic pen. You got your own wand. <laughs> Izzy Wizzy, let's get busy. <laughs> Originally called Smith's Tenement, the house thrived until 1695 when it began to decline. Should we go and explore? Oh look, so we can do a little trail as well. Our first stop, the incredible dining hall. <laughs> you got your sourcing hat on there. What can you see? A pumpkin. Where Tudors would have cooked 500 years ago, it was great to show the amazing fireplace to Charlotte in the kitchen. Yeah. Oh, that's all the veg to go with the pie. What's that, Charlotte? <laughs> Heading up to the bedchamber, there is a bed that once belonged to Welsh Archdeacon Edmund Price. Hey, Charlotte, can you see something on the bed? A little kitten. <laughs> with uneven floorboards and historic furniture, it's a room with so much character. Let's try on some armour. It's heavy, isn't it? That's chainmail. Ready for battle? Here we are. In the solar room, there's a chance for adults and children to try and replica Tudor costumes. So we did. Look at you, nice jacket. Trying out the Tudor attire? That's not too bad, is it? Matchy matchy in the Tudor times. Really great immersive fun. <laughs> you enjoying that? Plenty of lovely spots for lunch outside. <laughs> Two together, that's the way. Even the garden is inspired by Tudor times with a traditional cottage garden feel and what better way to explore it than taking on a Harry Potter dragon egg hunt. Charlotte, I spot another egg. Can you see it? Here it is. The museum has existed since 1916 <laughs> and welcomes thousands of school children each year in visits. It was down to George Cadbury, founder of Bourneville, who saved this remarkable building and arranged its move from Selly Oak to where it stands today. With lots of fun events on throughout the year, this truly is an interesting place to visit. <laughs>